Hi, my name is John Austin. I'm a product marketing manager within Microchip's Analog and Interface Products Division. This video is intended to provide you an overview of the Thermocouple Demo Board. The Thermocouple Demo Board is a complete solution using the MCP9804 temperature sensor, the MCP3421 analog to digital converter, and the PIC 18F2550 USB microcontroller. Let us start with a general overview of the Thermocouple Demo Board. There are three microchip components used along with the K-type thermocouple. The MCP9804 is used for the cold junction temperature compensation. The MCP3421 is used to measure the differential voltage of the thermocouple and the PIC 18F2550 USB microcontroller is used for the math computations and the USB interface communication to the PC. The MCP9804 is used for the cold junction temperature compensation or the reference temperature for the thermocouple. This is a high accuracy silicon temperature sensor with a nominal temperature accuracy of 0.25 degrees C from minus 40 C to plus 125 degrees C. The MCP9804 has a user programmable resolution of 0.5 degrees C, 0.25 degrees C, 0.125 degrees C, or 0.0625 degrees C. This device offers a very low power solution in a miniature 2 mm by 3 mm package. The MCP3421 is a fully differential input analog to digital converter with 18 bits of resolution with an onboard VREF and a user programmable gain amplifier. The ADC inputs are used to measure a differential voltage of the thermocouple. The internal PGA is set to a gain of 8 volts per volt which provides an additional 3 bits of resolution, increasing the effective resolution of the circuit to 21 bits. Let's get started. First, you will need to install the thermal management software. Once you have installed the software, you will need to open it. Now that the software is open, you can connect the demo board to the PC through the USB connector on the bottom of the PCB. Notice that the software automatically recognizes the demo board is connected to the PC. Now click the box that says Enable Thermocouple. You will see that the box labeled K-Type, EMF, and Thermocouple are now populated with numeric values. The box labeled K-Type EMF gives the thermocouple voltage and the box labeled thermocouple gives the linearized temperature value corresponding to that particular thermocouple voltage. Now we need to enable the cold junction temperature compensation. Notice that the box labeled MCP9804 sensor is now populated with the temperature value corresponding to the ambient temperature. You should also notice that the temperature value displayed for the thermocouple has been offset by the cold junction temperature value. If we click on the play bu button located in the top left corner of the software, you will data log the temperature of both the thermocouple and the MCP9804. The bar at the bottom of the screen increases and decreases the sampling frequency from 100 milliseconds to 1000 milliseconds. Now if we click on the tab at the top of the screen labeled M MCP9804 setup, this screen allows you to configure the user programmable features of the MCP9804. The hysteresis can be configured by selecting 0, 1.5, 3, or 6 degrees. The resolution can be set from 0.5 degrees to 0 0.0625 degrees C. The device can be set to continuous or shutdown mode. In the continuous mode, the MCP9804 continuously converts temperature and updates the internal temperature reg register. In shutdown mode, the device is shut down until the temperature reading is requested. The device also has an alert output that can be enabled. Once enabled, the user can select either comparator or interrupt mode with an active high or an active low output. The user can input an upper temperature limit, lower temperature limit, and critical temperature limits. When the ambient temperature of the MCP9804 meets any of these user-defined conditions, the box will turn red. That completes my demonstration of the Thermocouple Demo Board. I hope you found this video useful. For more information about Microchip's analog products, please visit www.microchip.com forward slash analog.